Is it visible now? Yes. 10 minutes from now. Please go ahead. Good afternoon to all the jury members and all the panelists. Uh, my name is Dinesh Kothari. I am from Surat. Today, I have developed a tool which is an intelligent AI-driven cost-effective tool which will transform your uh, remind, uh, manual reminders into an automation which will be tailored for every client every time free of cost. So if you look about the industry context, many of the chartered accountants are into uh, SIP or mutual fund distribution and insurance consulting. So uh, sending the reminders to the client again and again that your insurance premium is due, your SIP is due is a difficult task. If you don't send messages, then there are chances of bounces and uh, it carries a dissatisfaction among the clients. So uh, what is the solution? At present, uh, if I have passed an NISM exam, I can either my associate myself with a big mutual fund distributor, use their software, and uh, I have to uh, give a share from my commission to him. So uh, if I use that software, the thing will be I have to uh, do a manual login, login again and again uh, to send a message to the client that your SIP is due and so It cannot fully automate all the client list. For example, on uh, 6th of September, there are more than 100 clients whose SIP is due. I can't send messages to all of them at a one go if i am a direct distributor i can't uh, i am not having my own software the software which i am uh, i will be taking from a third party will be very expensive as compared to the insurance uh, commission which i earn so there is no direct uh, file from the bsc or nsc to do the same uh, I can't use a WhatsApp broad broadcast because broadcast will send a same message to all the participants. It will not customize the message. And uh, using an API tool from WhatsApp will again and again involve the cost. So as of now, there is no true automation solution exists for uh, mapping SIP, uh, managing SIP reminders. Why? What is the main problem? Every client has a different SIP date. The SIP amount is different. The bank account from which it will be debited is different. And if I'm paying for my wife, my children, so I should be aware that from which date, which amount will be debited from which account of my wife account from my child account. So a uh, simple bulk messaging system will not work uh, by sending the manual uh, reminders. It will take a lot of time and it is not scalable. So what I've done, I have taken a raw data sheet, which I get from the portal of uh, BSC or NSC. Uh, from that raw data sheet, I need to send a message uh, using Google Chrome. So for that, I have taken a helper sheet where which will be maintained by me, uh, client name, mobile number will be written, bank account will be written. Uh, it will, uh, I will, uh, I will use uh, a Python script. So that Python script is generated with the help of uh, uh, chat GPT. So uh, that chat GPT will give me the Python script. The Excel will directly send the messages using Google Chrome, uh, using WhatsApp web Selenium. So we will see how it works, first of all. So this is the sheet which I have got from uh, BSC portal. Uh, it's a raw sheet. Uh, for example, uh, Rohit uh, is having an SIP in Parak Parik for amount of 35,000 on 6th September, that is tomorrow. Nitesh is having two SIP uh, in two different funds on 6th September. Shiv Shankar is also having some SIPs. Uh, so this is the raw data which I get from the portal. After that, if I look, uh, there is no contact list over there. And also uh, we don't have uh, the bank from which it will be debited. So here is the contact list of Rohit and the bank from which it will be debited uh, along with the contact uh, number of it. It is a helper file for me. So I have given the prompt to the chat GPT that I need, uh, I need a Python script which will automate the uh, process. I have given the folder path that this is the raw file uh, in this saved in this folder. The column C contains the client name client name, column K contain the SIP amount and column L contain the SIP dates. And uh, in the helper sheet, ABC is client name, mobile number and bank. We have mentioned over here. So I have given in that I need to send a message and a new sheet should be created by like this in such a format. And the message format should be said that respected investor, uh, it will give the uh, salutation based on the time which I am sending. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. The chat will decide. Uh, SIP date will be there, the bank will be there, the amount will be there, total amount of SIP and investor name. Uh, I have given a filter of two days because uh, I get data sheet on the first of uh, the month. I have to send message till the 30th, last date of the month. So I can't send a uh, message all together. I need to send two days before. So I have filtered. So those SIP who's, uh, who are due, uh, who, uh, which are due in the next two days will be reminded. Otherwise, it will be blank. If I will again run that, it will send the message to them. So after this, it has given me a script. I will run the Python script. We will see what happens over there. So the Python script is running. 
it is selected the clients to whom uh, message is to be sent now uh, using the selenium uh, it is automatically taking the charge of the whatsapp whatsapp web google chrome using google chrome the message uh, the whatsapp web is being loaded it will first of all search for the first client whose name was there in the uh, excel sheet along with the helper sheet uh, in which the number was written it will search the contact it will frame the message which was required to be sent so the first message is being sent to the person whose sip is due on 6th of november uh, september it will say, run for the second client it will check uh, yeah it is checking due to connectivity issues i think there might be some time for sending the messages and uh, whatsapp being loaded if the number is not on whatsapp like as the case uh, there was a third investor whose non the number was not on whatsapp so it will wait for uh, 30 seconds if the number is not uh, being found then it will uh, show that the phone number is or the url is invalid and will not send the message to that particular client it will directly stop the process and will get uh, log out from it we will wait for the 30 seconds for the process to complete so the process has been completed if we look a, a third file has been created in this third file the message has been sent to all the persons message has been sent to all the person whose sip was late nitesh was having sip on 6th so message has been sent with time spent time stamp uh, shiv shankar was having an invalid mo mobile number the sip reminder has failed rajesh was having sip on 8th so the status is blank the message was not sent to him because it was given code that way so this was for the ones uh, who are into industry so we will have a look why this tool this tool has an uh, personalization built in every amount is different every date is different every client name is different so it will be sending to all the list of clients uh, on their individual basis uh, there is no client uh, login required in any software it it can work even if you are not having any software with you it is a zero cost tool you need uh, you don't need any whatsapp api tool for uh, sending the messages uh, this was the one for the one who are sending uh, using uh, in the industry for the practicing chartered accountants since 15 september is coming there is another tool which we can see which is made from the same concept here is the client list whom i need to send a reminder that your uh, uh, return is uh, due on 15 september please send data by 10 september yeah yeah, yeah. so if the message is filled filed if i have filed the return in my uh, office so a message will not be required to be sent if the status is blank then it will send the message to that particular client so i will show how it will run for the practicing chartered accountants this can act as a savior tool because we have more than 1000 uh, clients whose uh, itr is pending to be filed every day we check that uh, certain are filed and certain are not filed and we need to send a reminder message again and again to them so if your uh, client you have filed the itr for that particular client it will not send message to that particular client it will search for another client whose uh, itr was not filed and will send message to only that particular client so it is sending to that particular client whose itr was not filed so this you can uh, use this tool again and again on a certain period of time after 5 days uh, to update the client and act as a reminder that your itr is due uh, kindly send the document at our office on so and so that time is being taken just because uh, it is taking a time to load the whatsapp due to network issues it's fine i think dinesh ji you are very clear with the use case that we have presented yes sir venu sir so, any questions that you have got uh, no questions we can go to the next part sir thank, thank you, you sir. dinesh thank you thank you